Hello everyone, it's been a very very long time since I made a video. Um, today I'm just gonna do a inspired look it's from a Korean celebrity again. And her name is Hyuna, she was in Wonder Girls, but now she's in a group called 4Minute. And as I was watching their video, um, it's called Music. Hyuna has several looks in that video, but I did like one particular look, which was her bright orange lipstick and her piercing eyes. So I tried to recreate that look, and today's um, emphasis is definitely going to be on the lips with this bright orange colored lipstick. Hope you guys enjoy this video, and if you guys have any questions, please let me know on the comments. Oh, by the way, um, before I um, start the tutorial, I already did my face before I started filming because I wasn't sure if I was going to make a tutorial or not. I know everyone's gonna have something basic like these two colors. This is a beige color and this is a brown color and I'm literally just gonna use these two shades. First what you want to do is use a full feet brush like this and dab it on the beige color and just sweep it all over your lid. right into the inner corner too. Sorry about the outside noise. I don't know why, but every time I try to make a video, it just seems like the neighborhood is under crisis. All right, now I'm just gonna use the same brush and dab the brown on the tip of it like this. And try to concentrate the color more towards your lash line, not all over the place, and more towards the outside right here on your outer crease. And the reason why I'm using a fluffy brush is I don't want the colors too concentrated, and um, I could blend as I'm applying the colors. Alright, next is one of my favorite parts, which is drawing the eyeliner. I like to draw it thick, and I think this look actually requires a thick eyeliner. So I'm just going to use my Stila Smudge Pot and a Bobbi Brown's Ultra Fine Eyeliner Brush. Alright, see how thick my eyeliners are? That's how thick you want to go. And using a small eyeshadow brush and a matte black shadow, this is Carbon by MAC, just um, set your eyeliner so it could stay the way it is longer. And right here, just try to blend out the colors by slightly dragging it out so your eyes could look a little bit wider and as if it has more depth in it. Like so. Alright, now I'm just going to use an eyelash curler and curl my lashes. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to stack two eyelashes on top of each other for the upper lash line, lashes for the base, and then I'm going to use a little bit more dramatic and party-like lashes on top of it so it could create huge lashes. The first lashes I'm going to use are from Revlon. I got these 
as a tryout from Revlon themselves and it's the self-adhesive false lashes so I don't have to apply any lash glue which is really great Just put it on where I want to put it on okay these are my base lashes Alright, while we're waiting for the lashes to settle in, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to retouch the stuff that kind of faded. Alright, now using a small brush and anything whoa, that you want to use on your inner corner. I'm not going to do a lot of face stuff. I am going to add a little bit of blush on my cheeks, which is going to be this MIX blush. Now, I'm going to use this Shiseido lipstick, which is really, really orange, and the color actually does come out like this. So, try to be careful, and instead of sweeping it across your lips, I'm just going to dab it on. Alright, now all we have to do is do the eyebrows. My eyebrows are kind of bushy at the moment because I am trying to do something else with my eyebrows. Um, what I'm going to do is use the eyeliner brush that I used before and it does have a little bit of shadow left. So what I'm just going to do is try to fill in the gaps with it. And using a clean brush, what I'm going to do is just disperse the shadow color around my brows so it doesn't look so awkward. Alright, and you are done. If you want to do something extra on yourself, that is totally okay. If you want to contour your face or whatnot, that's okay too. Um, and I hope you guys enjoy the tutorial. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!